Super Mobile. Welcome back, everyone. Drake Hopkins again, and we're playing some more Humankind. Hope you guys are having yourselves a fantastic day. We're uh, down here uh, in the new continent. I don't really know what it is, but we're going to explore the whole darn thing, and we're going to take over uh, these guys. So let's see what we can do as far as uh, making some of that start happening this turn, uh, this this uh, episode. I'd like to bring more units in. Do we have more uh, available? Well, this is a ship that needs to get over here to get itself prepared. Uh, we got some dudes on the beach here. Got to pick up the pace. 70 influence. That's nice. World deed accomplished. Mount Rayma was not discovered by anyone. No, so this must be the undiscovered country that somebody else found first. Like, this must be the new world option. Because, you know, pretty sure that's the case. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, plop a... Um, something down here. We'll look around at the rest of that place first. Um, you guys, are we able to upgrade you? Not in not in the middle of their territory, I suppose. I, I could jump across the beach here. Maybe not. Maybe not necessary. Over this way. Uh, let's keep you scouting. Yeah, see, lo lots and lots of resources available out here. Lots of them. Let's see, let's make everybody do their quick uh, run. So the uh, capital, or the uh, main continent here, we definitely need to bring in more um, more stuff. I wonder if there's any civics that are higher priority than what we were looking at here. Um, enacting civics for 20% cheaper is, sounds great. Rents Empire Revolution is unlikely to be an issue. Famous last words, I'm sure, but um, stability would be pretty impressive with this. That's basically 15 to 20 stability per place. And the influence is only like 3 to 4, which sounds less impressive. Stability sounds so much more impressive there. And again, um, spending money in order to increase stability in the city. Is that a one time that permanently grab adds stability? Um, is this for just holy sites? Because if that's the case, it's way too late. Um, so I think I think we'll go with this one. Because this seems like spending this amount now is better than spending it later. Because if we enact another another civic of any sort, we're going to increase the cost of enacting this one. That is a huge jump. If different wow. opinions can't be heard, people might end up believing whatever ridiculous things the government says. Indeed. Every way and every... Whoa. That's a lot of influence coming across the seas. A little concerned about that. is this 99% Aztec hold no that's not Aztecs amount of influence produced by the Aztecs in this territory zero hanging gardens of Babylon how is that possible that maybe they oh they just absorbed that oh oh are you at war with the Persians you are definitely at war with the Persians Pretty sure there's uh, some pretty nasty going on there. That's great. We're not involved in it, but that's hilarious. You guys have what as far as troop types? Yeah, see, that's going to be a... I'll get myself mashed up if we're fighting just those. All right, well, let's bring another batch across then. What do we got? Um, we can bring these chariots over. Uh, and they can come down to here. great you guys can come across as well or maybe this group can come across as well they'll take their time that's okay all right we're uh, sitting there pretty uh pretty slow on the fame we're only at two stars so far need to improve that dramatically uh, populations continuing to grow in each of the cities we're not expanding very quickly we're kind of exploring the world the is of okay fine buddy we'll accept <laughs> yes, the non-aggression very good treaty. this i like Keepers. Oh, well played! Right. Well played! Buy out your resources too. We were slacking on that. That's very ineffective. Um, your empire is an enigma. Yeah, you're not my friend, huh? Okay, how about uh, we make a uh, trade off? Do something clever today. Because Sign this treaty. Good. <laughs> yes, Excellent. very good. Uh, we'll this make some like. money by uh, improve and improve things by using our international you trade have options. You nerve showing your face. Yeah, whatever, Miss Kelty. Lucy Lou. Stuff it, Lucy Lou. Um, 
Alright, we'll withdraw the demand. Offer treaty. Oops, I just realized I accepted. Ah, click too quick. I accepted her treaty demand. Or her rebuttal. Amy. No, but I did. Uh, stability, money, market quarters, 2% food for tea. Pretty good. Uh, in fact, we'll just take all of these. Well, we won't right now because we're short on cash. We don't make a lot of cash, which is a little more than a little concerning. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Keep scouting, guys. Keep scouting. Uh, I'm actually going to go ahead and uh, have a peek around here while we wait for the others to join. Scout the rest of this. If we could scout the whole continent, that would be lovely. That would be quite swell, you know? Uh, did I have more turf up here? Yeah, that was taken in, so that's good. You are on the shores now, that's good. You can head back and disband. I'm thinking we, I mean, it's probable that none of the units that we're gonna, that we, where are you, where did you guys come from? What the heck? What? 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 <laughs> out of, out of the, I'm glad I noticed him. Totally out of the blue though. The Visigoths are ransacking our t Oh, what the heck. A uh, hi. Visigoths definitely want to ransack, but uh, let's do this. Bring it, Goths. What do you have for troops? You have all spearmen, which means I'm going to put my spearmen on the front line here. Oh, this is a bad spot to do battle. Oh my gosh, that was a dumb spot to do battle. Okay. All right, mistakes were made. Slightly overzealous on the uh, on the combat here. Okay, let's pop out of the deployment sta stage here. These are warriors. Can you get into this combat? No, not immediately. What do we got here? More uh, melee friends. A couple rounds, you'll be able to get in there. That's too bad. I mean, I, I can get you next round, so we'll move you up anyways. All right. Memphis is interrupted, too. That's awkward. Let's see what we got for a vision around the world here. <clears throat> That's their actual lands. So this is the legitimate Celtic lands, I think. Are Celtic lands? The Celts, yeah? Yeah, you're, you're the Celts, yeah. Medieval Celts. Oh, we got somebody pink on down here. Okay. Now, you guys were looking for... Uh... Oh. Hello? 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 Into a ghost town. Right, claim that one. Come over here. Oh no, you don't need to go up the hill. There you go. Off we go. Now you can go up the scout. Let's see what we got here. Oh, hello. Who's the yellow? I don't know. I do not know. And I am. Okay, well, whoever it is, they've got land claimed on the continent tip here. I think the right thing though to do is to scout that because uh, until we. Yeah, we're not going to be able to uh, explore the whole continent if that is part of it, and it's outside of our range. All right, you guys need to be repaired. <clears throat> oh, I spent all my money on merchant type stuff. Are you repairing there? Yeah, you will. Let's let you heal up. You can hit the shores when it's your turn. Um, there. Sus is done. It can help with Notre Dame. We have the combat. All right, let's get into it. Oh, they are going to be able to get around. Okay. Interesting. Can I get around to anywhere else? Can't no, I don't think I can. Let's go. All right. You come up yeah. this way and this way. Pull in here. Charge. Almost finished that guy off. And we'll pull in here just for... Oh, no, we can get angle. We can get attack. Charge. Now, we're coming off the river tiles, but... Is not ideal, but he's on the lower ground. Here. Two of them downed. What I'm gonna do is just pull you back to the flag, let you pull in here, and uh, I think we'll scoot around here, and around here. Uh, can you get not quite in range? You can come down this way though. I don't think he can hit through there. No, he can't. Uh, we'll take that guy, and you can take that guy. Wow, little skirmish with a barbarian. This is literally like a 
Oh, what? What? Did he just... I just went from low ground to high ground while I'm on a river with a horseman. Ouch! That was dumb, Drake. That was next level dumb. Follow me. No, oh, seriously, right, genius. Go. Serves you right. right that uh, attack is no one. As is that. That was a waste. Well, that's one way to thin out the excess number of troops. Get yourself dead by being down. Oh, military star. Nice. That was worth it. Uh, that's odd, eh? Because that they just I don't know where they came from unless they spawn up in here. Maybe, because that's not claimed yet. That's possible. It is possible. Alright, um, next. Anybody left to move? Good, you'll get into a uh, home territory. I like it. Builder Star. Starting to roll in, that's nice. Some religious conversions happening, population increase and decrease as they fluctuate all the time. The Celts have bought some of our lead. Well, enjoy making spoons of it, please, Celts. <clears throat> I would appreciate that. These are... Oh, Magyar. Okay, well, um, Magyar, I'm gonna... I'm gonna say we'll step out of the way. We'll just, uh, scoot on out of there. Hmm. Some porcelain throughout the area. I like it. Um, what I'm gonna do here is Let's just go. split you guys up. Right there and there. And each of you can go on to auto run. That's really what I want to do here with you. You're going to head up to discover whomever that is. You'll come down this way and then try to get up here, please. You are a boat that can go up here and have a sleep. Do some regroup with yourself. I don't want to know what you're really doing there, but, you know, we'll leave it to him. Um, over here, we have these highly mobile friends here. We can come down, back down to Memphis. Actually, not into Memphis, I guess. Into there. We hang out between the pyramids. Off we go. Oh, somewhere there is fine. Uh, and you're gonna come join them. We'll just have like a little squadron of mobiles hanging out near Memphis. These guys, I'm gonna actually disband. Now that they fought that one fight there, honestly, you're great. But uh, population is just being wasted on the, the money is being wasted on the population so badly. I'm using 139 a tur uh, turn to, up to maintain the army. It's just dumb. Just dumb. When I can rebuild new units later, right? And they're much easier to rebuild than they are to maintain at this point. We put the walls up in the capital. Science per researcher and two research slots is nice. Science per population is even nicer. More industry. Commerce. More industry. More industry. More science. Good, keep those going. Notre Dame will be done before then. So I grew up as a kid calling it Notre Dame. I'm on it. Um, but I know that's like really butchered bad pronunciation. Um, okay, you guys are gonna head down to uh, to roll here to to roll the bad guys. But that's terrible. And this way. Um, I think we're actually gonna let you Everybody pop into the water and see the, the Celts. Uh, what? Where'd this? Where'd this happen? Oh, up here. Is this Celts? No, this is not Celts. This is. Um. I'm not sure who it is. But I'm just gonna retreat. Well, it must be a a city-state group. What are they called? Independent peoples. More combat? Oh, my goodness. Who are you with? Card-carrying jerks is who they are. In that turn, let's go off Your right empire now. becomes one of the giants, astride the globe. And what will you do with this power? Is that the Imperial Power research, then? Is that what that was? Ongoing ransack? What? What? Where did you come from? Oh, you came from across the shore. Of course you did. Um, that's awkward. Uh, let's bring him down. And you can come back up this way. At which times you will probably be able to get shot. 
get stabbed on the other side. Um, I'm feeling less confident in our troopage right now, but, you know. See, this isn't, uh, it's not an illegal act because we don't know who they are. We have yet to discover those fine people, so they don't give us a, a heads up that there's a problem there. I'll uh, bring you around and we'll scout over this way. You guys are high. Uh, very damaged units, actually. No doubt this independent people possess sophisticated customs, rights, language, what? and beliefs. How I do you hope you're oh. going to treat them well? Oh, that's counting, like, everybody in the area. Man, okay, the cities... The, the independent peoples are not... The Scots are not, uh... And the Magyars are not exactly pushovers that I expected. So our military is... Is less than stellar right now. That's what's going on. All right. Bring them back down here as well. Everything... Uh, everything troop-wise is coming south. And we'll do something with them when we get there, because... Um... Having them sit, sit around as police-keeping forces here is just not going to be useful to me. This guy can be upgraded to... Yeah, well... Yeah, we'll upgrade you. Because I will forget by then. I'll send you off to your watery grave and it'll all be sadness. Uh, down this way. Good. Uh, this fellow's going to have a heck of a time moving anywhere. The Ghanaians could be a challenge. Ghanaians. Will you oh. see their camels as part of their trade caravans or military formations? Hmm. Is that on the same continent? That's a little weird. The Ghanaians are the ones that, I'm sure, the ones that got that uh, continent explored or landed on first. First to set foot on the continent. It must have been them. Land and freedom. The empire's vast, glorious land. Uh, of mountains and grasslands stretching countless leagues and full of wonders and mysteries. Over many generations, your people have subdued many of its uh, corners and now must ask the question, to whom does this land truly belong? Should have thought about that before, people. Uh, there's communal land and inherited land options. Allow to claim, attach, and merge territories with money instead of influence. Bad idea for us. Uh, or enact communal land over here, which would be plus 10 food per number of attached territories on all cities. Wow, that's pretty substantial. Mm-hmm. Not bad at all. Uh, way over my budget, so we clearly need to improve things. Oof. I'm not sure that I'm... not sure that I'm going to keep up here. I'm concerned that our... our Disadvantage here is going to start this getting where I even agree. worse. Greetings. I'm a good neighbor and a loyal friend. Except for to as the... long as you don't cross me. Yeah, unless you're newbie. Something to make our affairs oh more my. civil. Oh this my. sounds like a good deal. We need to. We need to money up. <laughs> we, we need to start getting some cash. One of the agrarian stars. Oh yeah. yeah Notre Dame. Yeah. An impressive achievement built at a time when scientific inquiry and growing faith marched hand in hand. Indeed. An interesting time. Very proven, oh my goodness. Wait a second. It exploits everything around it. Really? You all the wonders do that, and I've just missed it all this time. What? They seem to do exactly that. Oh. Well, I should have known that. What a noob. Okay, well, that's wonderful. I bet you guys screamed at me about that more than once. Aztecs forgave a grievance. Uh, claim to border terror. Well, that was, that was kind of them. It was very nice of you. In fact, you're a solid trade partner that we want to keep in good standing with for sure. Long term, good standing with them. Because that leaves this border uh, effectively an undefended border. Canadian-esque. All right, there is our last, this will be our last tenant. No, our second last tenant. Okay, what do we got? Influence on commons. Um, mandate patronage. Create religious authorities and rights in distant lands to ensure tithe collections for the homeland. Plus money per number of trade routes on a city center. That could be quite potent considering we're pushing for trade. Uh, permanent land movement. Ooh. Permanent land and sea movement. 
Science per alliance. That's not a lot. That is a minuscule amount. War score. Not really urgently on that. 15 industry from main plaza. See, the main plazas, when they're built, have 100 and some. So not, that doesn't really seem like... This one looks good. This one looks good. I mean, increased movement permanently? Seems like a good idea. But then so does a whole lot more money. Thinking like we're getting two per trade. So if we have, what now, 12, 10 or 12 trades right now? I mean, that's only 20 bucks. So would I trade 20 bucks a turn for one movement? Yeah, I would. I think I'll stick with, I think I'll go with the movement. That's where my gut's telling me is the best choice. Uh, at 165, we can get our last tenant of the phase. So we also get the chance to build a new holy You should state. listen to this. Um, ah, non-aggression pact you. with them? Benefit, Except think. right now, I mean, my focus is on the new accept. continent in the midst there. So having positive relations with these guys right now would be nice. If we could do open borders, I would be happy with that. Do something clever today. I will definitely Sign this accept treaty. that. I will definitely You'll need that. to offer more. Uh, that's fine. A little cash to get the open borders. So let me scout the turf and uh, uh, look around the lands, anyways. Uh, yeah, we already talked to you. Right, you. Okay, this has been absorbed into actual Celtic lands, which is a little disturbing. Uh, we'll go up this way now. Back to the early days of exploration, huh? Um, I really wish these guys would do a better job of exploring, but we're gonna try to let them do it again. See if this works this time. Uh, a couple boats to run about, run amok in the oceans of time, or whatever the saying be. You are gonna bring your units down here as well. I mean, we're gonna need like train routes and airdrops to, to really interact with the other these other continents. Um, okay, obelisk. Faith obelisk. Where do we put this? Is there a faith push anywhere? Not really. There's scrappings of it around the borders. You guys do have some faith there. Um, I'm thinking we hold off and build a to conquer this city if we can and then as soon as we do we build a um, holy site there so uh, now <clears throat> we've been working on some commercial work here for the coasts so let's continue that process sus also needs to grab these guys we don't have the numbers for it yet we will next turn however um, can you get in here yet you sure can Let's do that. And then these other two will both be available at that point. Good. A couple more districts there is not a bad idea. You're sitting at 100%, right? So uh, I think that's a great idea. Harbors and all the infrastructure needs to go in place here right away. I'm just going to spam them all in in any partic no particular order. I don't really care at, that, at this point. You just put it all in. You've got your two districts going in for the commerce. It's fine. Uh, Kerma. Uh, you put in your dock down here, and I'd really love it if you could do more with that. Now, I don't think you can until we get the sites down this far. Are we going to have industrial sites down this way? I mean, these are commercial, and they're making like seven bucks a piece. If we put if we put another one, come on, there we go. Put another one in there. They both get. All three of them are now nine bucks a piece, so that's pretty solid. What's our our industrial or our stability is nice and high there right now. A couple of those will be good, and then again we'll go ahead and put all the infrastructure we can into place. Why do you not have it available? But we need a research center in order to get that. Put that one in. That's fine. Hey, okay, let's have a look at Thebes. Thick as Thebes. Can I put in the commercial coastal line here? I can. Good. And this guy's going to need something over here. I'm thinking you're going to have a dock there. What do we do with these ones? Um, I mean, I could put in three farmer's quarters here, or we could have put in a bunch of commercial... No, you know what? We do need farmer's quarters in here. So let's do that and that. And Thebes has decent stability reclaimed again over the last while, which is good. 
Very good. And then we'll go ahead with a bunch more um, infrastructure build there. Good. And how about Memphis? How are we doing here, Memphis? This dude's still hanging out here. Come on. Memphis. There we go. Um, we have only a couple of infrastructure. They have no functional docks here. Is that entirely going to remain the way that way? No. We're going to put some up here. I'm going to put a harbor in where? I'm not sure, actually. Probably something over here, maybe. We can access it from here. Um, but we're going to put in a few more, a few industrial... Oh, no, not in there yet. Can't do that yet, so let's go with the... Uh, Um, hmm. Thinking. Thanks, but I don't need the warnings. Uh, well, we had a bunch of stuff we had planned to do here. So Memphis is having food issues, right? It's It's got seven people and does not have a lot of food production right now. So what I'm going to do is put in a few um, exploitables here. Like we'll put in there, there, there sort of thing. Straight across. One, two, three at least. Uh, farmer's quarters in there. That'll exploit all of this field. They'll get big, big swaths of access for territory here. And we can actually do the double and triple at some point if we need to. They don't have to use them, but having the districts in there is good. Uh, and we can always offset them with more stability. We're even putting in another garrison, and we're at 100% already. So that might be a little... And more districts, or more um, stability stuff. So we probably don't need all that right now. Uh, let's run these back down the line until after these other districts... Um, I could put in, like, some things like this. Like, that's nine turns, but it's permanent to influence. We could put in this to add the five food in. That would be probably a wise choice. It's just a permanent five food with no cost. Uh, a little more faith, probably a good idea as well. It's also a five-turn job. It's not, it's not stellar, but it's something useful. We'll throw that in, in the pl place there. Memphis has a has our big research facility here. I don't think we'll go. Well, no, we could definitely go further on the research. I mean, that is some seriously solid research growth if we did that. I like that idea. Um, you guys get some good commercial bonuses off your proximities, and. Uh, it's okay for now. I'd like some more industrial work in Memphis, because it is still taking two or three, it's still taking three turns to build things now. We really kind of got to step that game up. So let's use that to sneak our way through here, and then we'll industrialize that zone. Okay, battle somewhere. You guys aren't able to run. Crap. Crap a doodles. Uh, I think this is a loss. I think this is entirely 100% loss. Um, pretty sure, yeah, we're just gonna get shot to bits. Yeah, we're not, I don't think we're even gonna make it through this round. No. Wow, okay. So the Celts showed us, uh, not to mess with them, that's for sure. We're gonna leave these guys out of this battle for now. <laughs> let them, let them escape with their tails between their legs. That was the first round. Can I kill this guy? Not a chance. Nope. Oh! That's it. That's your turn, dude. That's your turn. Dang. What about your jerks? <laughs> it can't spurn me down. Uh, these are our boats. They can uh, go off and peacefully do other things that will not get us dead. Lovely. Uh, you guys stopped burning down to roll? Well, that's kind of you. Follow me. Okay. We anchor across the bridge. We need, we need a little bridge line there. Come over here. Ouch! That is, uh, we're not steamrolling like I thought we might in this area areas. Yikes. Okay. Um, I wouldn't mind having enough ships to actually hit them at sea. Uh, hey! Hey, you're, oh, you're a barbarian. Well, we'll instant resolve and lose that guy as well. Well, this has not turned out uh, like a po positive turn, has it? Get all uh, bloated head from kill killing off the uh, Nubians early and thinking I'm all that and a box of chocolates. Apparently not. Let's go. Um, 
Now, we could actually make one of these into a city, right? And then expand into the next one. And the city itself could be the this. We can also set up that city. And, uh... Not a great idea. Not really a great idea. Um, we could settle something even different nearby there. I do like the idea of absorbing those guys in. That seems like a grand idea. But maybe we need some other resources. Like, there's a ton of porcelain right in here, for instance. And iron. Oh no, there's two porcelain, iron, this is two porcelain, and copper. If I did this province, this province, this one, and this one as a city, that would be fairly... Fairly substantial. Oh, some tactics something researched. Where was it? Siege tactics researched. Excellent. So siege tactics lets us have the stronger ballista when we're um, fighting in battles, as well as our armies can now add another unit. Now that brings us to the end of the... Only the end of the ancient era, which is terrifyingly bad. Uh, let's go feudalism, because that's the colony booster. We'll see how that works. So we get that tech before we settle, for sure. Now let's look at where we're going to settle here. 1217. Okay, let's head off this way, though. I want to run this way and have a look at uh, other options. Into the waters, friends. You can't be attacking from the land, can you? Oh. Not. Uh, did we just get it? Just got a cog. All right, off to auto explore, my friend. <laughs> you're an actual substantially decent explorer, like that. You're legitimately an explorer. Except for you're gonna sit around in the ocean, back and forth, in the deep blue sea. Oh my God, the AI exploration stuff is not inducive to sanity. Not to my sanity. Hey, this guy's gonna stop here for a moment. <laughs> just back and forth, back and forth. He's got no no objective at all. I just appeared in this world. What do you expect from me? All right, now over here, if we were to settle this, I definitely want access to all of this goodies here. Uh, this is some pretty substantial industrial capacity. How about over here for food? If we do a, if we do this sort of thing, this twelve seventeen, that might be the go-to. Uh, you know what? I should, I should look at the rest of this. Let's look at the rest of this, and we'll come back for that scout. This guy can move his way through here and have a vision later. You're gonna come up north, or up top here, anyways. Oh my goodness, it's a long haul. Hey, okay. they definitely got their foot on the ground. Are you guys still trying to get on the land? Oh my gosh. Your wonderful game. <laughs> the the exploration is is slightly uh, painful. Wisdom of others. <clears throat> Merchants trek the world, trade markets uh, in far climes, and sell their your highly prized natural riches for much coin. Conversely, your empire sees many traders from distant lands visit your plazas with their goods, um, their wit, and their provocative ideas. <clears throat> when their knowledge contradicts the wisdom of the elders, it raises the question of who you should trust. Knowledge authorities. Okay, elders wisdom or foreign innovation. Um, science per number of trade routes. Or science per researcher. I'm thinking the number of trade routes is more likely to work now, but I don't think that's where I want my 1300 bucks to go. Uh, land rights would give us food. Why should individual wealth first? and political connections determine the status of something <clears throat> as timeless as the land? could be the, the stability, land. but we're not desperate for stability yet. People who have been told to move, please move. Oh, ye of little movement points. We get this over here, please. Uh, that, that, this spot is so done. <laughs> Do we, do we settle something there? I think we're going to settle up here. I think we're pretty uh, bent on settling up this way. So let's have a look around. See what you can give us for info. Well, you can give us some lovely things for info. Um, let's just do this, please. This cog can head down here. You're supposed to be heading at least somewhere semi-safe. 
Um, head down this way. Unfortunately, the Scots are likely to burn down our, our lands. This is one of the early era guys. Oh, I'm not going to fight him. Not going to fight him. That is our, that is our ally. All right, we've got a battle here. What is going on here? Um, interesting. I'm not really sure how this is going to play out. We're in the water. We have to stay in the water. Um, who gets the military strength? 30, you have 11. I mean, in deployment? Oh, bugger. Uh, are you going to be able to shoot these guys without massive penalties? I don't know. How much damage can we do this? Instant all. Like, kill them dead. I love it. Uh, let's do that again. Go up here. Oh, you know what I can do? You can sail ahead here. You can pull up on the land. I don't think I can shoot from the land here. Okay, interesting. End that round and see what he does. You can't, you, you can't do a thing is what you do. Um, so we'll corner that spot and we'll start shooting here. Um... Ready all, throw. Was that outside the battle zone? That is weird. Oh, that's a... Yeah, right, of course it is, because it's a... It's a wonder that we can't actually move. That's fine. Charge. We'll go here. Attack. Put in on this guy. We'll let these guys spawn in, because I want them to. That and I will end the round here. Let them re. Oh, there. We'll let them spawn the next one next turn. That's fine. Uh, you're gonna head up to friendly turf before you do anything else. Ah, trade everything. Accepted. A pleasure Accepted, to accept. Accepted, friend. How about you are the alliance? Do hmm? something clever today. Hmm? Sign this treaty. You do. Your proposal it. is too much of a ball and chain on my ambitions. Okay. I would call Way that to... decision interesting. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yeah, so would I. <laughs> so would I. That's interesting. You uh you won't uh trade with me or you won't uh, be an ally. You just want my luxury res or my <laughs> my strategic resources. Interesting, friend. All right, so we get uh, vision up there. That's nice. Uh, you're going to be able to give us some eyes out in the water. Good, good. Okay. Man, it's nice having the extra movement point, to tell you that much. Not That's complaining good. about that. Um, Come over here. Ooh. Over Looky here, boys. Some lovely turf. Uh, that would actually be a fairly, fairly defensible land. Um... Very defensible land. Not very uh, agricultural, but I mean, you could settle there. And you could, yeah, you could definitely make something of that tile with some gold and some nearby marble. Uh, now this guy wanted, we wanted to. Oh, yeah, he already used his movement. Anybody else? No. Okay. Ah, uh, yes, you, you, my friend. Let's go up here and see what we can see. We're really just wanting to get max vision as fast as possible on this continent. I want you guys to come over this way. Like here is fine. You guys come over this way as well. Okay, hop in the water, friend. Um, weird, but okay, I guess. Did that way. Good. Ah, the pastoral English. Leave them to their farms and everything should be fine. And uh, maybe get rid of the yew trees. <laughs> Just got that. <laughs> maybe get rid of the yew trees. That's, that's what you make a longbow out of, traditionally. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I'd say. I'd say we get rid of the u -tree. Yeah, see, that's going to be the end of that outpost. That's unfortunate. I'm really not... Don't want to mess with it. I don't want to scrap with them right now. And anything over here that fights is going to deal with their entire coastal defense. Which is quite unfortunate. Very unfortunate, actually. 
Alright, let's join up and head down this way. I don't think we'll be able to get anywhere through there, honestly. So let's change plan there. Change tack, literally. Uh, you're gonna come up this way, then. Up into friendly-ish territory. At the cat. You can head off here, where you can then hop in the... Up on shore. You guys are gonna need to uh, just sleep it off. And... Hmm, a little more vision. Get us in there. Let's see what the neighbors have to offer. We have uh, friendly relations and freedom to, to roam. This is a big continent. <laughs> Bigger than I thought it was. Bigger than you ever seen! Um, that's unfortunate. He can't... He can move in there? He can, because there's five. Right, of course. A watery grave. A great coastal city of Sus sends a fishing crews uh, far up and down the surrounding coastline. Now one of the new crews has made a startling discovery. Wreckage from an ancient galley laying well, well, lays well preserved in shallow waters. After brief scouting, an experienced diver offers to explore with his gang and promises a fixed payoff for the Empire. Hmm. They warn that the expedition isn't for the inexperienced. What is your choice? We can mobilize. Our military can explore the wreckage alone. With a chance of unexpected event. We set up a contract, make 150 bucks. Um, we should let the dead sleep, lest we offend the old gods. Uh, increase faith for 10 turns. I'll take the 150 bucks. That's fine. And the battle. The tough battle. That was a that was a big one. I love having these ships in line, though. That was nice. Ready, all. Hop right back up in here, boys. Uh, we'll get over here. Unfortunately, these ships don't have like a uh, an assault capacity. Like um, they don't have a bombard, I guess, ability. Do they? I don't think so. No, they can't. I don't think they can fire ranged. No, one tile ranged. Okay, one tile range. All right, well, that's a good place to end things. Learning a bit still as we get into the uh, medieval era, finally, uh, in some substance. We have four, four star or five stars already, which means we could bump through really quickly. We do have a wonder. I think all the wonders have already been claimed from this era. Yeah, so we could possibly go ahead to try to get another wonder uh, in the next era. I really want to get something settled on, settled in up here. There's a lot to be had up here. There are. One, two, three, four provinces with substantial resources surrounding, including uh, this one that has substantial resources, and we can attach there. So we could go with a fairly, fairly large city here. Um, if we placed it well, we could probably get a pretty hefty production uh, city, or pretty hefty uh, financial city going here in the New World. So I'm excited to see what that has to offer, but thank you so much for joining me again. Hit the like button on your way out, and we'll see you tomorrow.